Hi, this is Infinity, and I'm going to show you how to put on the Sorgi tube on your own finger. This is 7 eighths. I probably should have bought 5 eighths, but I couldn't find it. So I'm going to put it on this ring finger, which has an injury on it. So the first thing you do is, first of all, get out. They call this an applicator. To me, it's more like a jig. You want to pre-cut the amount you want to use. So if you're going down to the entire finger, I would say to use two feet. I'm just going to use a smaller piece because I only want to wrap the top of my finger and it should probably be longer than this. And I practiced with this piece once already. So the first thing we're going to do is load the surgery tube into the holder and then put it on your finger or vice versa. So now the holder is on my finger and the surgery tube is all the way down. Now I only want to wrap the top of my finger, so I'm going to pull this up to about there. And then you have to hold on to the gauze, to the surgery tube, and pull off the applic applicator so that it hits the top of your fingernail. And then once it's cleared your fingernail, you're going to rotate it 360 degrees and then push it back in on top of the layer of gauze that's already on your finger. And this is not easy to do to yourself. And that's why the other YouTube videos I found, they were showing it doing done to someone else. All right, now very important. Hold on to the bottom of the new piece of gauze. I'm doing this with my thumb. Hold on to the bottom of the new piece of gauze while pushing the applicator off again. Just until it re clears your fingernail. And this time I'm only going to twist it once and then push it back in. Push it back in, get a new layer of gauze, and then hang on to that gauze. Hang on to that gauze with whatever finger you can, and then with your other hand, slide the surgery tube off. Let it clear your fingernail, rotate it. Uh, once. That's just like 180 degrees. Now it's getting thicker, so I'm having a harder time. Get, okay, good. So now I have some new tube, and I'm going to hold on to it with my pinky and my thumb, because I'm wrapping my fourth finger, my ring finger, to you non-musicians. Um, and then we're going to pull the metal jig out again. Pull it out again. There's still a little bit of gauze left, so one more time, 180 degree turn. And this time, I ran out of gauze. So now I'm going to hold on to the gauze and pull the applicator off. So, so now, your injury is cushioned and protected from being banged up and, and giving yourself further pain. Now this still might rotate, and the whole thing could just slide off in one fell swoop. So I'm going to use some tape. And I'm using paper surgical tape because it's more breathable. And I'm going to put it on the bottom. So now this isn't going anywhere. So now I can go out and do my errands and my shopping. And when I touch stuff, this is going to be nice and um, padded and not give me further pain from this injury that's been plaguing me for almost four months now. Okay, good luck, guys.